Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be reacting to a new game dropping from the Fun Pimps called Seven Days Blood Moons. And um, <laughs> I, I think I heard something about something like this coming out, but I don't, I don't know what it could be. Apparently it's a new Seven Days game. So let's check it out, see what it's about. I mean, it looks like the exact same game so far, so. Oh, that's new. They were placing down like silhouettes for items and then building them later which is not something you can typically do in this game, or at least you couldn't do in the original seven days. So kind of planning out your builds, which actually I think would be kind of nice in seven days to die uh, if they did something like that. But anyway, So far, I'm not seeing anything crazy different than what we're used to with this game. There was a, um, I think that was a wooden baton he was using before, which is new. I don't think I've ever seen a wooden one in this game. So maybe you can actually start by crafting one made out of wood yourself and then work your way up or something like that. Become the zombie hive master? The fuck does that mean? Okay. What the hell? Oh, wait a minute. What? Oh, so you can... This is like PvP? What? Hold on, okay. That's confusing. All right, give me one second. Um, Seven Days Blood Moon is a 4v1 fight to the death. Survivors fortify bases and scavenge for materials in their plight against the relentless horde. The zombie hive master commands and possesses the horde. Oh, so this is like this is like Dead by Daylight and and uh, maybe more so um, like Resident Evil Resistance or whatever. Which, if you guys know, that game was not received very well. Who? Wait a minute. Who was asking for? A PvP kind of game like this. Did anybody want this? And like, like, I'm not trying to be negative or whatever. Like, it could be really fun, but like, considering everybody's just really trying to get the console version working properly and make sure that the PC version is finally, definitively what it's going to be, it seems kind of odd that this just came out of nowhere when I haven't heard anybody even remotely mention that they would like anything even close to this when it comes to seven days to die. Maybe it's a market they're trying to just kind of capitalize on or something like that. I, I don't know, but this feels strange. I'm trying to figure out like, how would this work? What kind of content could you create to, to keep 
kind of prolonged interest in a mode like this. I don't know, man. I am not sure. Unless they plan on adding a substantial amount of like new traps and just ways to deal with the zombies and stuff like that. I don't know. This doesn't seem like it has a whole lot of staying power. It, it feels like one of those things that's just like, oh, that was cool for a while. I'm back to what I actually want to play, you know? I don't know. That feels feels a little strange. But uh, I don't know. I'll keep an eye on this as time goes on, and we'll just kind of just be checking it out periodically to see what exactly this is supposed to be and who it's supposed to appeal to because I can't even find any information about it. The only, like, the Steam page is up and you can wish list it, but outside of that, if you search for this game on YouTube, you don't find nothing. So I am interested and also confused. So, uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see about this one. Uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below about this and if you're interested in this at all were you one of those people who asked for this because i i don't i can't think of anybody i know in the community any people who i've played the game with or who i know play the game i, I just it, nothing comes to mind so let me know see you guys on the next one <laughs>